big country names are in the metro ready to perform for you. It's the final day of Country on the River, and KETV News Watch 7's Chin Doan is live at Tom Hannafin Park with more. Good morning, Chin. Hey, ladies, it's a great morning when you're listening to the band Perry. This is one of my favorite songs called You Lie. Listening to it on my iPhone, it pops. Okay, sounds great. <laughs> but you don't have to listen to it on your iPhone. Today, here, you can see them live and in person. It's going to be really exciting. You can see people behind me cleaning up the park, making sure it looks great for you. Gates open at 1, but I'm told at 9 o'clock, people are already starting to line up. In fact, some people even camped overnight in tents and RVs. That's how excited they are. Now, this is the first time this festival is here at Tom Hannafin Park, and it already sounds great. So it's your last chance for live country music today. Thousands will fill this park to see some familiar faces like the band Perry and then check out some new names. For those cowboys and cowgirls, you can also buy some boots and buckles here too. And also here, souvenirs and food trucks. Country on the River is a music festival that started in Wisconsin. 2014 marked the first year for the event here in Iowa. That was at the West Fair Fairgrounds. Organizers say the goal is to build this festival into one of the biggest in the Midwest. And this year's concert at Tom Hannafin Park took a lot of preparation, but it's well worth it. Months of planning go into it. Every detail is thought out, you know, garbage pickup, um, like I said, security, parking, camping. Again, gates open at 1, and then at 2, that's when the concert starts with Jackson Mickelson. Then it's all day of live music. Then the band Perry is at 10 o'clock. Tickets are $80 free for those under five. You can buy them here at the gate or online at countryontheriveriowa.com. We're live at Tom Hannafin Park, Chindone, KETV, Newswatch 7. Thanks, Chin. Sounds like a lot of fun.